Mm. I think you'd like that, wouldn't you? Mm. You were always a tease. I'm a whole level up from the kind of boys you're used to. A little girl is gonna get herself hurt if she's not careful. You wanna play some grown up games? Let's fucking do that, shall we? Come in. I'm nearly done for the day, so you'll have my full attention in about ten. Well, my my, a sight for sore eyes. What in the hell brings you back here? Graduated, nicely done. Spill the sauce. Full honors. I don't want to immediately go snarky on you, but no shit. You always were the model student. Oh, come on, who else in my class would have ripped through college so easily? It doesn't surprise me one bit. You in town for a while? Well, all right. I was just doing some marking, but I've always got time for a former student. Have a seat. Let's catch up a little. <sighs> Graduating. There's no fucking way. <laughs> Where did the time go? It seems like yesterday you were in my final year group in the front row, just over there. Yeah, you'd either have your head buried in a book or be paying attention more than everyone else in the class put together. I don't know what it was, you just always had this look about you whenever you were looking at the board or something I was pointing at. Call it the professor's intuition. You want a drink? Oh, you spotted mine. <laughs> I mean, it's not usually the school's policy to indulge that kind of... Well, I guess it's, a, you know, a former student. There's no rules, per se, around that. What harm can it do? I know you wouldn't let me go on it for the next hour if you couldn't get a sip, too. All right. All right, all right, you've got me. <laughs> Let's get a drink, then. I've got whiskey, rum bit of vodka, some Cokes in the fridge. You need them on a day like this. I'm boiling my ass off by this window. Vodka? My kind of girl. When's the ceremony? Two weeks to go. You got your dress and gown picked out? Oh, I'm invited. <laughs> oh, I wish I could, but I got a fortnight in the Caribbean booked out. Needed the time away. You still keep up with your extracurriculars? Yeah, I like the sports. <laughs> you remember all the hoop we did? Hey, I'm six foot five. I've got so much size on you, sweetheart. Don't even think about gobbing off about my performance on that court. <laughs> the number of times you'd try and rough me up. <laughs> hmm. It's a good job I always had a soft spot for you. Oh, come on. You never knew. Yada, yada, yada. Yeah, you were always my favorite. It wasn't even a fair contest. The brains, the looks, the personality. I mean, I always know you you were going to get the A in life. Was I your favorite teacher? No way. 
right? Everyone used to dig Mr. Swanson with his green sweater and horn-rimmed glasses, looking like a Cluedo character. <laughs> God damn. I needed this drink. It's so damn warm in here. You know what I was thinking about just the other day? That period I held Jeremy back just before you guys were leaving to college. The fucker was a week away from finishing school and still managed to think setting off all the fire alarms during the head speech was a solid idea. It was like 5 p.m. You were doing some prep for college. Math or something, I don't know. He was trying to flirt with you so hard. And I've got eyes and ears. I mean, I know when a dude is trying it on. Don't play dumb. <laughs> you were having none of it. What was it you said? It was like, um... Oh, yeah. Maybe if you hadn't hit every branch of the stupid tree on the way down, we could actually hold a civilized conversation. <laughs> You just started looking away from him, just averting your eyes like he was a big boil on your toe. But the thing was, you weren't just looking anywhere. You know, it wasn't like you just zoned out. You looked straight at me. Held my gaze. And neither of us broke it. It was like this rush of, hmm, I don't know, something. I know you felt it too. I still think about that sometimes. So many things we used to do together. I figured you'd get tired of the gamesmanship between the b-ball and the staring contests in class. No. You just got tired of playing with boys, didn't you? Hmm. Another? Oh, I've got some time for sure. I'm locking up today. No one's around. Truth or dare? Always escalating, aren't you? You know what? All right. Yeah. Let's have a little fun. Shoot your shot, young lady. I'm expecting some sharp barbs here. Anything less than my jaw on the floor, I'm going to be extremely disappointed. What? Uh, all right, touche. You did come to play. Who's asking? You were the vodka. No, I don't buy it. That's not the vodka talking. <laughs> I never sleep with a student. Obviously, that's totally inappropriate. Well, not a current one, anyway. My turn. Truth. You ever have a crush on a professor? Wow. Which one?
Are they going to make me guess? Kirkpatrick. Brown. Crawford. Damn, I'm all out of ideas. Those are all the passably attractive professors at your college. Better left unsaid, I guess. Hmm. Got me wondering, though. This heat. I'm just going to undo these shirt buttons a little bit more. Don't freak out. Just a little pecs on display. Hit me with something. You got me where you want me, right? Another truth. Let's have it. Do I want to sleep with a student? Oh, come on. We've already been over this. It's totally in a... Do I want to sleep with an ex-student? You're really getting to some tough questions, aren't you? What if I told you, yeah... What if I told you there was one particular student who had occupied my thoughts for the last four years? You might know her. Yeah, I think you might. Not a close friend, necessarily. Nor a former classmate. And what if I told you it was you? What are you going to do about it, you naughty girl? In fact... I dare you to do something about it. You're so insistent on playing games, we can start putting those words into action, can't we? Oh, giving me that glare isn't going to change who has the power in this classroom, kitten. Whoa, 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 whoa. I may be two vodkas in, but I'm still very aware of what those are. Now that's just not playing fair, is it, sweetie? Where were you hiding those the whole time? We can joke and kid around, but... I don't know if you know what you're getting yourself into here. I'm a whole level up from the kind of boys you're used to. A little girl is going to get herself hurt if she's not careful. some grown-up games. Let's fucking do that, shall we? Let's see what you can really handle. <laughs> 